So today we're gonna to take our mud road and turn it into a proper gravel road. So we'll first start with a good rock base. This big rock is 2B gravel. Now you can spread this stuff out pretty easy with just a triaxle. You can drive and dump this stuff at the same time. Now with any of this stuff, there's gotta be some skill involved. Now this guy's been doing it a while, so he's pretty good at it. Now once you get it down pretty even, you can go back in there with a dozer. Now in the muddy spots, you wanna make sure you have plenty of this rock base. Then you can fill in with the smaller rocks. Here's that delicate balance of tipping it just enough to get the rocks to flow out even. And once they start moving, you gotta start moving. So first you put down the big rocks, then the small rocks. Then once it's all smoothed out, you can compact it. Now just driving this dozer on it will compact it some, but this big compactor really does a good job. This thing's not just heavy, it's actually vibrating the gravel down. You can see the difference between the loose stuff and the compacted stuff. Pretty impressive machine. I mean, it looks really good. Once you roll over the gravel with this, it almost looks paved. Not bad for a gravel driveway. So here's that gravel all loosened up and here it's all compacted down. And you can see that small gravel really goes into the big gravel well, but it is nice having that good solid rock base. And it's really nice watching people that really know how to use this machinery. And who doesn't like playing with bulldozers? I mean, as a kid, how many hours have we played with these in the sandbox? I think we can all remember when we got our first Tonka truck. And of course, there was the Tonka dozer. It's almost like icing a cake. I mean, look how smooth this stuff is. If you've never driven a dozer, I'm sure you want to. Imagine going to an amusement park and saying, here's five bucks, give me five minutes. I mean, who doesn't like to play in the mud? There's no doubt this dozer's fun. Now, of course, it's really fun when you can get that gravel to do what you want it to do. I mean, try doing this with a shovel. Now that I think of it, I have. These toys make quick work of this stuff. I bet if you close your eyes right now, you're in the sandbox. You wonder why they don't make an amusement park where you can just drive this stuff around. I'm sure some lawyer could tell me why. What? Liability? Just show me where to sign. Then let the fun begin. So if you're thinking about putting in a gravel driveway and you're just not sure how to go about it, hopefully this video will give you some ideas on how to start. Well, I appreciate your time and thanks for watching.